G'day folks, welcome to um, a couple of minutes showing you the garden here. It's my turn to have a bit of a go here this afternoon, just after 7 o'clock. And uh, let's get started with the first few pot plants here. These are just on the side fence here, a bit of basil. That's just some sort of flower. A spare tomato on its own. And then these four here have got um, capsicums. The capsicums are growing. So we can see there, I'm not sure what sort of type of they are, I think they're the long sort of green ones. Um, on the deck here we've got <clears throat> a whole lot of basil, uh, just lined up there, and different flowers. Let's move into the backyard here. So along the side here we've got tomatoes and pot plants. A couple of them have also got some pumpkins sort of growing, so I must have dropped the pumpkin seeds here. So we notice with these tomatoes flowering there's uh, flowers on them as we can see here so hopefully there's a lot of bees around in the next few days start getting the pollination happening all right so there's our tomatoes along the um, garage here let's move to the back of the house here back fence this is a grape uh, vine that's just exploded and climbing up this uh, tree here in the backyard and then of course it runs all along the back fence both this way and that way so there's the, um, the vine and you know with this hot weather it's not really good for the grapes but yeah well, there are grapes here and there so hopefully we'll get a bit of a feed out of these fig trees in the back up here there's a figs just sitting there and down here we've got our compost bin. So this is where I sort of throw in some of the greens and recycle it. Now, along the bottom here we've got some pumpkins. Along the back fence there here underneath the grapevine, the vine. Let's have a bit of a look through this angle. Right, so there's uh, pumpkins. As we move into this little bed here, we've uh, recently I added some eggplants. Don't know how much these heats have done to them today. I soaked them well this morning, but they look reasonable. They haven't really taken off yet, but hopefully we start seeing something in the next couple of weeks. And here we've got the main garden. So along the back here with the fence in the middle, I've got another whole row of pumpkins. Hot weather's really screwed them around a bit today. These are some leftover letters, the last lot, so I'm just allowing some of these to um, grow seeds, collect them for the next um, next lot, next year, whatever. So here's my tomatoes in the, um, in the garden bed. I have a bit of a close-up of one or two in a sec. And along the fence here on this end, I've got uh, beans and peas. They're all kind of mixed up and I've kind of, uh, I'm going to allow them to sort of climb up. Got some more rope up the top there, so I'm going to be putting a whole lot of string and rope and let them climb up and whatever happens, happens, and get some beans happening. So there's a bit of a close-up of some of these tomatoes. Probably not as uh, mature as the ones in the pot plants that I showed earlier, but um, growing a little bit slower here in the main garden. But yeah, this soil this morning I, I was soaking, and look at it, it's already dry as at the moment, so I'll give it another soak before... Getting off before it gets dark tonight. So yeah, there's a little bit of my garden and what we have. I uh, don't know if I forgot anything, but that's it. Maresi.